Hello viewers, welcome back to DMARC DKIM. In this video, you will learn how to authenticate your email domain with help of Salesforce, SPF, DKIM and DMARC records. So let's start. On your Salesforce dashboard, click on the settings icon. Now go to open advanced setup. Here, go to emails. Now go to DKIM keys. Click create new key. And now here you are going to select the key size 2048 bit as it is more secure. And in the selector field, write SF1. In alternate selector, write SF2. Now write down your domain and the domain match pattern field will automatically fill out with your domain name. Click save and here you have two DKIM records. Add these records to your DNS provider. My DNS provider is Cloudflare. I have logged in my Cloudflare account and here I will go to my domain, click on the DNS tab, then go to record section and then click add record. Here select type CNAME and now copy the record name from Salesforce, add it in the name field, then copy the record value and add it in the target field turn off the proxy because when proxy is turned on it diverts the traffic to your dns server instead of going to your email server which can cause authentication issues now add the second dkim record now you need to activate the dkim keys for this refresh the page and this active button will be enabled Click here and your DKIM record is now verified. It may take longer for some to activate their DKIM key, but usually it happens immediately. Next, we will add the SPF value. You can find Salesforce SPF value on dmarkdkim.com setup guide. The link is in the description. Go to the article and here you will have the written instructions for adding DKIM, SPF and DMARC. Copy this SPF value. And in your DNS dashboard, select type TXT, write down your domain name in the name field, then add this SPF value in the content field and save this record. Moving on to the DMARC record, you can utilize dmarkdkim.com DMARC tool, which helps you implement a strict policy and it also provides you insights into your DMARC reports. Link is in the description. Just add your domain name here, then click check and this tool analyzes your domain for any misconfigurations or any existing DMARC value and here it points out that your domain has multiple SPF records. In this case you can use the SPF merge tool, link is in the description. As you see there are two SPF records on my DNS dashboard so I am going to delete one and then combine both SPF values to get a single merged value. Copy the Salesforce SPF value and on the SPF merge tool add your domain name then add the Salesforce SPF and click merge SPF values. Here you get a merged value just add it to your existing SPF record and you are good to go. Now let's continue with adding the DMARC record. Copy this DMARC value and Paste it into your DNS provider. After adding the DMARC record, click sign up now to get access to the reports dashboard. And here you will need to add your business email. And if you are just starting with this tool, you will need to verify your domain by adding the domain ownership record to your DNS provider. Once you have added both the domain ownership and the DMARC records, then click check DNS records and then your domain will be set up for receiving the DMARC reports and it will start receiving reports after 24 hours. This tool allows you to have insights into the DKIM SPF alignment and it provides you step-by-step -step guidance on how to set up a strict policy. Moreover, you can also see your DNS history. In this tab, you can have the list of all records you have added to your DNS provider. If you delete any record from the DNS dashboard, that record will be available in the DNS history. This way you can recover your deleted records from here. So guys, that's all you need to do for authenticating your Salesforce emails. And after doing this, your emails will not go to the spam folder and they will be protected against scams. If you have any queries, feel free to ask in the comment section. 
If you want our help in setting up your domain authentication, then you can go to the link in the description for scheduling a meeting and one of our experts will help you out with your domain authentication process. Thank you so much for tuning in. Don't forget to like and subscribe the channel. I will see you in the next video. Till then, take care and have a good day.